Hey guys, it's Carmine from CAD Custom, Melbourne Tullamarine. We've uh, got a HQ GDS four-door in the build. Uh, it's a really nice street car that we've um, had brought in. We're just doing the outside of the car as the owners. He's actually built the car correctly. He's monster motor, running gear, tub work, all the underneath's done. It was looking a bit sad on the outside, so he's brought it to us. Once we got it bare metal, we found that um, the roof was really nasty with rust. Um, overall a really good body except for the roof, that's uh, due to it had a vinyl roof on it so over the years it um, perished the roof. Adrian from KBS has, has sent us some product and we're really grateful. We've got the rust seal here that I've strained into my uh, 3M disposable gun. Um, I've already cleaned it, I've masked it up and cleaned it. What I have done is epoxied the outside of the roof uh, to save time. But we've gone through the KBS cleaning treatment with the AquaClean first to get rid of any loose rust. Um, it's, it's like a degreasing agent as well. And then uh, the rust blast after is more of an etch and a cleaning etch to prepare the surface for the, the rust seal. I've strained it into the gun. We're going to go in the booth now and, and cover it. It's um, ready to use. You can also brush it. I've got the brush here. I will actually brush the pillars later on before we put the roof on. But it's, it's ready to go and it will so totally seal the roof, lock everything down. And, and have the roof ready. So we've actually just masked up the sides of the roof where it's going to be welded on so there's no KBS, no epoxy, it's still bare metal so when it's TIG welded up it'll still penetrate perfectly. But um, yeah, let's get the KBS on it and see what it comes up like. So you can see the roofs, I've taped it all up just so uh, for penetration of welding. It's been prepped with the appropriate cleaners. Outside's epoxy, so now I'll, I'll plug the airline in and away we go. I've put one really good coat with a little bit of a cover coat after it. Um, I've put it on with a 1.8 tip, it's fairly thick that way. I, I didn't reduce it out of the tin, straight into a gun with a fairly large tip. That way too you can cut your coats down and just uh, get it on nice and even with one really good coat. Save time and, um, and not waste as much product as well. So it's got a really generous coat on it now. So um, yeah, we'll, we'll let it dry and get it on the roof. Just brushing the KBS rust seal on. I'm going to leave these bits bare metal because we've got to graft the, the new roof that we just painted on. So I'm just making sure that all this old, old, uh, it's all been cleaned and prepped, but this old metal uh, with the KBS rust seal on it, it's going to give this, 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 this area will outlive the, they outlive the car anyway. So we're just making it bulletproof using this product so I'm um, very grateful too that we've got KBS helping us out so most people would um, you know weld roofs on or panels on and not and not do this and, and you know and it, it will last for a period but this is just making it foolproof and knowing that you've sealed it that no rust will raise its head basically and, and give you dramas and when particularly when people are spending the amounts of money on cars and getting them done right you've, you've got to take every avenue to make it foolproof so longevity uh, is, is, is a key so yeah it's just going to go around and brush it around on all the areas on the inside um, so then we can graft the roof on.